everybody. My name is Puppet Dean from the Geeky Puppet Show. Here on the Geeky Puppet Show today for what? For what? For Hawkman. What for? What for? What for? For Hawkman, the man in the sky, using the weapons of the past to fight the evils of the present. But before we get into this fantastic book, let's go ahead and meet our cast. Uh, the one asking what for, he's small, he's green, he is our lead, he's froggy! Hello, my good chaps. Hello! <laughs> If you look right down there, you can see her. She's right there. She's every woman in the world. In our narrator, it's Maranya. And good, good evening, everyone. And she's behind her. Mind controlling Maranya is that evil tree. He's not evil. That, that's why it's always there. It's always there because of that. Wow. Who's that papa now? <laughs> <laughs> wow. Let's go ahead, though. Uh, I can't <clears throat> see Maranya. Okay, here we go. I can read it. Okay. (laughs) Hawkman, uncanny creature of the night, is the Hawkman. Winged and powerful, he fights the evils of the present with the ancient weapons of the past. In reality, the Hawkman is Carter Hall, brilliant young scientist who was attending an auction of arms and armor on Fifth Avenue. I use use ancient weapons and Asian weapons. I don't discriminate. That's it, ancient. How much am I bid for this fine Spanish blunderbuss? What a name. Owned by Cortez and other famous explorers. Carter Hall is interested in adding the unusual weapon to his collection. Hmm. Looks like the real thing. All right. I bid $500. I bid a thousand dollars. It isn't worth that, you know. I'm a collector of weapons. That's why I want it. I don't care about that. I bid a thousand. Fifteen hundred dollars. Two thousand dollars I bid. (laughs) Ah, the mysterious gentleman outbids Carter Hall and receives the old gun. Something's queer when a man bids twice as much as a gun is worth. I'll follow him and see where he goes, and I'll steal the gun! Ha 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 Ah, his curiosity to rouse? Just his curiosity, huh? Hey. Carter Hall follows his rival bidder. That's the destination of the blunderbuss. Or boos, whatever you prefer. Blunderbuss. Blunderbuss. Ha <laughs> ha. I believe the hawk, man. We'll have to look into this. To the hawk cave. That night, Carter Hall dons his wings and appears once more as the Hawkman. On tonight's errand, I'll take along an Italian stiletto used by Cesare Borgia. Uh, yeah, I I don't care. At least I'm not wearing. At least I'm not wearing stilettos. Uh, you, just, you just use them. Borgia. <laughs> Borgia. <clears throat> the hawk flies to the house where the gun was taken. There are no lights on. Huh. Just like Puppetine. So nobody's home. Since it's too early for them to be asleep. Mm-hmm. I wonder. Entering the house, the Hawkman finds a Spanish blunderbuss. They took the gun apart. Those bastards. Trying to solve its secrets. I have a much simpler pen. Okay, with the sharp tip of his dagger, the Hawkman probes into the muzzle of the gun. I probe a lot. I'm a great at probing. Yes, you are. And he draws out a rolled up scroll of parchment. A map. Buried treasure, probably. That's why they wanted the gun so badly. Mm-mm. Oh, don't look, girls. There's an apple shot. Uh, the hawk here is so incoming. Wow, he's got good hearing. And slips silently into a closet. <laughs> Pixel, what are you doing here? 
Ah, a moment later, three men enter the room. Bring him in, Charlie. We'll make him talk, or else. Ah, the auctioneer is a prisoner. You sold the gun. So you must know it's secret. Talk or blow your brains out. That, that's no secret, I tell you. It's just a Spanish blunderbuss. Help! Help! Someone! As I'm in this man's home. Help! The Hawkman springs into action. <laughs> now, you thugs start talking. Or else. I mean, I don't have any more stilettos to throw, but... I have, mighty, I have my mighty nipples to look at. We'll talk. Hey, that weapon you have, it was uh, used by Cesar uh, Borgia, yes? Ah, uh, yes, it was. Not Borgia. You understand that, yes? Yes. <laughs> okay. We'll talk. A man out west wired us to buy the gun. We thought there was something valuable in it, so we tried to find the secret. And you slimy guy. Yeah, he had thought the auction I was in on it. And we went to get him to show it to us. Who was the man who wanted the gun? We never met him, but he has his card. I believe he lives in Colorado. Oh, Taking the blunderbuss and the auctioneer, the hawk leaves. Later, we find him in his home as Carter Hall. I'll build the gun to the man that wants it. Do, 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 do. John Denver of Colorado, pack a few things and take a plane there. Do, 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 Rocky do, Mountain do, do. High in Colorado. He was born in the summer <laughs> of his 27th year. <laughs> okay. He sends the blunderbuss and map to John Denver in Colorado. I will reach Colorado shortly, sir. Thank you. You're welcome. Then taxis to the northern airport to fly west. Ah, there is the westbound plane. Won't be long. Beats traveling in a box. Mm -hmm. I wonder what sort of adventure I'm getting into now. I'll soon know. We're over the canyon already. Next day in a hotel in Carson, Colorado. Carson, Colorado? Carson, Colorado? Carson, Colorado! Oh, he's a redhead now. And looks like a woman. Yeah, he does. Hey, now to dye my Hawkman clothes, I won't need the medieval axe just yet. Wow, he does. They really skinny him out in this back panel. I'm getting into character. Yeah. Denver, oh. the sex change capital. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Over the rocky ridges of Colorado sails the Hawkman. Here's the old mine. That map was genuine, all right. And now I'm speaking Southern because we're going on the treasure chest. What do you oh. say it is genuine here? Just so hey, you know. Hey, I'll do what I want, partner. Hi. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Suddenly, the hawk's sensitive ears pick out the sound of an approaching horseman. I'll bet a dollar <laughs> to a donut that that's that uh, singer, John Denver. Shame, he's not right on his motorcycle. He traded for a horse. Mm -hmm. He's got that blunderbuss. And found the map and the barrel. Woo-wee! This is gonna be great. Oh, jeez. The hawk flies down the mine shaft. I like going into dark, deep places without right. people's permission. I bet you do. I'll follow him and see what he's up to. In the dark. How can I see in the dark? <laughs> Big John. No, there's gold, all right. But I haven't I seen it. I found gold! 
Shut up. <laughs> There's gold, all right. But I haven't seen old Jace Gold Cash. I'll look further off. <laughs> Cache. Cache. Whatever. You heard it both ways. Uh -huh. Heard it both ways. That's uh, right. A cable car is heard coming down the shaft. Someone's coming. Woohoo! Gift cars! I'll give whoever it is a rousing reception. The occupant of the car is a girl. John Denver, what are you doing in my father's mind? <laughs> oh, well, you know, sorry, Goldie. I was just writing another song, you know. I'm going to make a big one day. <laughs> but I has doubled on this mind. Thought I'd uh, look around. I came across the location of this mine in Dad's diary. That's nice. Read more free comics online. Yeah. Flying after the couple, the hawk loses himself in the intricate maze of the mine. I'm now naked and a devil. Ha ha ha. While John Denver decides that the time for diplomacy has ended, he threatens Goldie in an effort to learn the secret of the gold cash. <laughs> If you don't tell me where your pa buried his gold, I'll choke you. Or that rope gives me a better idea. I mean, if you kill her, you dumbass, how could you give me the gold? Ah, uh, Goldie is abandoned in the old mine. I'll leave you here for a day or two. Maybe then you'll talk. The hawk hears her screams. <laughs> I knew my bulge would find her. Mm-hmm. That girl down there. That passageway. She's got nice boots. Look at those gams! Uh-huh. He finds and frees the girl. I heard you scream when I got aroused. I'm sorry. I know <laughs> I'm known as the Hawkman from New York City. New, New York, York City. City! Did you bring some salsa? Uh, I, I don't think we have salsa in New York. That's more of a Chi Chi thing, which is like not invented for a couple more years. Uh, um, but you know, that Denver guy, he found a map <laughs> and he maybe started speaking like a southerner. <laughs> it's infectious, ain't it? He'll stop at nothing to get the gold. He thought I knew where the hidden cash is, but I don't. Isn't it cash, eh? No, it's cash. Is it E at the end? Yeah, cash. Still cash. Sound Johnny Cash. <laughs> the Hawkman takes her home. Hmm. Oh, geez. How can I thank you? Um, um. <laughs> uh, don't try. My old lady will kill me. <laughs> yes, she will. I'm going hunting for the lost gold. Cache. I'll let you know if I find it. He basically um. said, down, girl. <laughs> <laughs> ah, the Hawkman returns to his hotel for his medieval axe. I have a sneaking feeling I'll need this. Ah, then heads for the gold mine. And sights two riders. <laughs> that mirror giant is lined. <laughs> <laughs> There's Denver with that looks like an old time miner. Hey, hey, oh, you know where the old Jake buried his gold and I'll talk for money. Yeah. Miner or Mortis. You well, took my role. Oh, that's don't... not your role, you're fucking hot man. I, I was gonna be Prospector Willie. <laughs> you are not gonna be. We'll split it 50-50. Flying low, the hawk listens to their conversation. Old Jake flooded the lowest section of the mine and hid his gold under that. But I guess the water is shut away after all these years. And I found the mine, so the rest should be easy. That's all I wanted to know. The he Hawk leaves. Yes. <laughs> the Hawkman soars high into the air. 
Oh, jeez. The Hawkman reaches the mine ahead of Denver and the Miner and speeds <laughs> down the shaft. This is making me feel uncomfortable. Wait, that's, that's you, not me. <laughs> On the next episode of The Boys, Hawkman flies down a shaft. Oh. And sneezes. Ooh, the next. <laughs> the miner said the lowest level of the mine. Mm, this must be his. The Hawkman finds the spot. Rare for a guy to do that. <laughs> I, I'll, I, uh, I'm having performance issues because of you. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'll bet that hold is in the lost gold's hiding place. Ah, with his axe, he smashes the oaken door at the floor in the floor of the tunnel. Here's Johnny. Yep. The hidden cache, and it is cash, of gold is revealed, but Whew! A fortune in gold. Wait, what's that? Voices. Someone's coming. Well, I know it's not Dr. Kidoff. <clears throat> Denver and the Miner, 49er, pick their way through the tunnels. Swinks! Is this the head right around that passageway? Ah, the Hawk oh, God, Man. old man. The Hawkman hides. Denver and the Miner, 49er. Oh, here it is. What did I tell you? The gold! In half of it's mine. Half mine. But John Denver is determined not to share the gold. Scum. Slowly his hand drops to the gun in his side. His finger tightens on the trigger. And every issue of this, Puppetine is killed. <laughs> yep. Denver's gun more. It's better him than me. <laughs> Murder's okay as long as it's not me. Right. Denver's gun roars. The unsuspecting miner clutches wildly and sinks to the ground. Shot in the back. Ow. Oh, my back! <laughs> ah, furious of such treachery, the Hawkman leaps forward and sends the man sparling. You yellow dog. Wow. That's because of my pants, ain't it? <laughs> yeah. A few minutes later, the hawk rises from the badly beaten body of the outlaw. Oh, yeah. it's because I'm racist and you're Asian. Mm -hmm. Now do cart him to the jailhouse. This time he doesn't kill him. Hey. Ah, Goldie is awakened sometime later that evening. I've been watching you. Mm -hmm. quite some time, <laughs> as you can see by my crotch. Now wait, this is, she's wearing that, and then this is in this. Okay. Wow, well, it takes her 15 minutes to get ready, okay? Yeah, yeah. Goldie, wake up. <laughs> Goldie, wake up. I've located the lost gold cache. Or uh, catch. Ah, uh, the girl is overawed by the gold. And his crutch. Uh huh. Look at the gold. Why? I'm wealthy. Oh, Hawk, I can never thank you for your help. Ah, but I am thankful that there are people like you who devote their lives to helping others. Don't worry, I left a hickey on your neck. Yeah, it looks like he did. With an appreciative smile, the Hawkman bows low and fades into the night. Mm -hmm. I am the Night Hawk. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Watch for another thrilling fight between the Hawkman and the evil of present day in next month's issue of. Flash Comics! Da, da, da. Hawkman didn't end up killing anyone this issue! Yay! Whoa! Shock it that's, off! That's an, uh, that's an achievement for to him. To be honest, I could have saved the old man. <laughs> you could have, so I guess... You I let him die! <laughs> you're responsible for that. But that is the end. We want to thank you so much. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Helps out the channel a lot. That's about it for us. Uh, be on the lookout for more comics coming soon and uh, the reviews. But that's about it for now. Thank you, and we'll see you next time. Bye! Goodbye. I like to watch. I bet you do. Rocky Mountain High, Colorado. Going down them shafts. Oh, look at my...